everybody. So this is a uh, next episode of Gen Toys. I don't even remember what episode it is. It's like five or six or something. But uh, we're back. I'm Dad. This is a kid. Say hello. Now today we have this awesome toy to tell you about. Tell us a little bit about this toy. Um, like if you press this, you can see it on the back right here. You press it down like this, and his arm goes up. Wait, let me be right back, okay? Bye. I'll see you in a minute. So while he's back, or while he's gone, let me tell you a little bit more about this guy. Um, this guy. Uh, is from Imaginex. He's brand new as far as I know, although we got him in a clearance at Target for like seven bucks. But the cool thing about this, and Imaginex, if you don't know anything about it, it's kind of like, um, these guys are really conscious, or th these designers are really good about, uh, thinking back to play sets when they were kids. Um, so there's a lot of Master of the Universe kind of actions on these, like just for example, like a button to use a hand fist, although I think that was a Thundercats thing, um, they had like mechanical spiders, which I believe Masters of the Universe had as well, so they're really in tune with all the different like uh, uh, conventions of, uh, of really good action figures, I consider Masters of the Universe to be really good action figures, because they have so many uh, features, right, um, so many gimmicks. So this guy, uh, all the Imagine X lines are really in tune to that, um, even outside of the franchise stuff that they have, like the DC stuff and the SpongeBob stuff. They're really in tune with this. But the thing that caught my eye about this one is if any of you are familiar with the Bioshock video games, uh, those first-person shooters where it's kind of like 1950s sci-fi <clears throat> and you're in this underwater city, and there's these big daddies, um, these robot suits that go around and harvest, uh, um, I don't even remember the storyline, but there's these big guy suits that you go around in, big daddy suits, and you, and, uh, <clears throat> you go around in one of these suits, and it has a drill and all that. <clears throat> oh, thanks. <clears throat> so, this is basically uh, a big daddy and it even comes with a drill I didn't I didn't bring it down but it comes with a little drill add-on which is exactly what big daddy um, has uh, as one of his tools in um, Bioshock so this if you want like a kid friendly even an adult friendly big daddy action figure with some articulation this is it this is a sweet figure and I don't know where my uh, teammate went. Oh, here's my teammate. He's coming back now to tell you a little bit more about this guy's features. What else is going on with this guy? Um, like, I forgot where the drill is for it. So when you press this, it's, it's, this is the hand where you put the drill in. So when you press this, it looks like he's drilling. And is there, like, a, a guy that comes with it or anything like that or something like that? Yup. Oh, so it opens up. Wow. And there's a guy you can actually fit an Imagine X scale dude into the uh, cockpit. And here's kind of what the cockpit looks like on the inside. I think there's a little controller that's in there. Can't really see him that well. Um, but really awesome figure. Uh, and it really caught my eye. It caught his eye. He doesn't play Bioshock, but he knows of it because um, it's pretty violent. But. Um, I thought this was really cool because I'm not really, I'm sure there's Bioshock figures um, out there. Well, that's kind of close, but it's another Imagine X type no, thing. You can pop it in if you want to turn the screen. And that is the Batman weirdo thing. That's just another Imagine X uh, toy, and it just gives it, you. It, it's, a, it's a robot, but. It's a robot, but this robot is like a little bit bigger. You kind of get the sense of how in tune they are with like making things playable, um, and that again has a lot of articulation. This can come off of him. And they're. It can come off of him, and there's like little flippers. Yeah, it's like, him. and that's the DC franchise that they work with too. And this is awesome too because I, I think it's three and up. Imagine X is three and up probably. 
But I mean, I think this beats the toilet paper roll rule where it doesn't, if you can stick something through a toilet paper roll, um, it's not safe for an infant. Um, but these guys are a little bit too beefy, I think, to fit through a toilet paper roll. And if I'm not, if I'm wrong, I'm sorry. I, I apologize. But I know he was playing with Imagine X before he was three. And we didn't have no problems. As long as you play with your kids and monitor what they're doing, play all you want. Go nuts, right? Just don't give them shuriken or anything like that, right? Mm-hmm. All right. Well, we're going to take off now. This is a really cool toy. We recommend you trying to find it. Um, I think it's probably not in stores anymore, but you should be able to find it at eBay because it's pretty new as far as I know. We just saw it in the store randomly, right? Anything else you want to say? All right. Happy Valentine's Day. See ya.